Good evening, ladies and gentlemen. My name is Colin Hanna from Let Freedom Ring, and on behalf of the host committee, I welcome you to tonight's salute to Paul Wyrick. In just a few moments, I will invite you to join me in saying our pledge. But first, I want to direct your attention to the term salute. Tonight is a salute to Paul Weyrich. And as many of you know, when we stand and say the Pledge of Allegiance and we place our, heart, our hand over our heart, that is technically referred to as a civilian salute. Some of you may know that last summer, Senator Jim Inhofe, who will be joining us later tonight, Senator Inhofe uh, passed a bill in the Senate that would have specifically codified something that is currently permitted but not widely known, and it has to do with a salute. And that is that those who served in the military, when in civilian attire, would be encouraged to render a military salute on the occasion of the reciting of the pledge or the singing of the national anthem. So in the spirit of that salute, I invite you all now to please stand and those who served in the United States military, please render a military salute, the rest of you a civilian salute as we say our Pledge of Allegiance. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the Republic for which it stands, one nation under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Thank you very much. Please have a seat. As I said a few moments ago, it is on behalf of the extraordinary host committee that I welcome you. Two members of that host committee who were instrumental in making tonight the success that it is. May I have your attention, please? Two members of our host committee are deeply disappointed that they are unable to be with us tonight. Morton Blackwell of the Leadership Institute and Ed Fulner of the Heritage Foundation. They are both, by a long, long time commitment, seven or 8,000 miles away from us tonight, in Tokyo where they're attending the Mount Pelerin Society. We're going to begin tonight with a special greeting from both Morton Blackwell and Ed Fulner. And just before we begin that, I want to point out that this evening, in addition to a wonderful address from Chris Plant, the rest of the night will be a series of video salutes. And that's because there are so many people who owe so much to Paul Weyrich that it literally would not be possible to accommodate them all at a microphone. So the first of those are Morton Blackwell and Ed Fulner. <laughs> 